Hi guys, it's me Stace. Welcome to another Toddler Tuesday. Today we're making a popsicle puzzle out of um, jumbo size craft sticks. Let me share with you the ones I made already. And I have them numbered. Okay, so this one I made of Frankenstein. Any fun? All right, then we have this one as a pumpkin. And these are numbered as well. I have here. Isn't that cute? All right. All you need are the jumbo size craft sticks. You're going to need six of those. I'm going to lay them out. And they're really easy little crafty little ones. I love this one. All right, then just take another popsicle stick to make sure they're straight and there's no gaps in them. Okay, then just take some tape. You can use masking tape, painter's tape. And all this is gonna do is hold it together while the little one colors on it. Okay, now flip them over and color. Now with the Frankenstein, I just use regular crayons and then with the pumpkin, I use markers. And we're going to do another pumpkin. So I'm going to grab my orange marker here. And this is just the Sharpie markers. But any marker would work. I mean, the little ones, the Crayola markers, washable markers, I think, and anything is fine. And then just draw your shape on there for your pumpkin. And then color it in. So if you don't want to use markers, you can use paint, um, crayons. Another fun idea is that you could use photographs that you have. You know, a great way, like, you know, you, if you have, like, a really good photo of, like, one person to where they're the focal point, not too busy, you can glue that onto your picture on your puzzle. And you just flip it over and cut it out on the back. You can do images off the Internet. You can do images of the little one's color in a coloring book. I mean, all kinds of ways you can jazz these up. For the pumpkin's easy to draw, so we're gonna go ahead and do this one. And you can always do like sets of four. Um, you could do a pumpkin, the Frankenstein, a ghost, maybe a witch. For the ghost, since it's white, I probably paint the popsicle six black first, and then just paint on the white ghost. I mean, you could do the letters. You can do alphabets. You know, if they want to learn their letters or numbers, all kinds of ways you can do these. All right, so we have the base of our pumpkin. I'm going to grab a black marker and go ahead and draw in his triangle eye and color that in. And another really good idea, I just thought of that, you can take them, um, you can get the magnets, um, you know, just regular magnets, you can get them at the craft store and put magnets on the back and then it can be like a little um, refrigerator kind of game with magnets and if you use the magnets you can take a few of these and just put them in a box like a set of four pick yourself up a cookie sheet at the dollar store and it could be a really cute um, travel car game because the magnets will stick to the cookie sheet okay so let's get this guy colored in all right then last we have the stem and i'm going to do it green I mean, you want to just use simple images, you know, because even though you're only using six puzzle pieces or six popsicle sticks, it does get kind of hard. You know, just use it for whatever the age is. You know, you go from there. All right, so we have our pumpkin done. Flip it over. I'm going to number them. One through six. Okay. Take the tape off. And then you can just kind of let go of them like that, put them in a little rubber band, and have little ones put them together. So we're going to put this one together. There's number one, two, three, four, five, six. And then when they're all done, you know, they're no longer playing with it, 
You can certainly flip it over and take another, um, you know, like a few more popsicle sticks, put them on the back, and make it be like a fence, you know. And then you can always put on the picture on a picture frame or on the fridge a gift to grandma and grandpa. Really fun idea, and it just costs you a few dollars for the popsicle sticks, and you probably already have the paint markers and crayons already on hand. But really fun, and these are called the Popsicle Puzzle. Any questions at all, please let me know. As always, thanks so much for watching. Have a great day, and I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.